Okay, let us briefly touch upon what is meant by condensation and freezing. Condensation is basically the process from which a gas changes into liquid by cooling. Okay, and freezing is the process by which a liquid turns into solid and again this also happens through cooling. Now a change of gas to liquid happens because the particles of gas we know are very far off to each other. As cooling starts to take place what happens is that the kinetic energy which we know and we saw in the earlier videos is very high in case of gases keeps becoming slower and slower. As these become slow their force of attraction starts increasing okay and as this force of attraction starts increasing they turn into liquids okay so that's how basically the conversion of a gas into liquid takes place now let's see the reverse of it from a liquid to a solid again just like we saw that zero degree is the melting point of the ice so as it increases from zero to above ice starts melting and converts itself from solid to liquid. On the vice versa, as the temperature goes down from zero to anything in minus, this liquid changes its, its form from liquid to solid. So this process of solid to liquid took place through heating, whereas liquid to solid takes place through cooling. Okay, and this basically again happens because as this is cooled, the particles of liquid which were hitherto in any case closer become even more close to each other. Why? Because they lose their kinetic energy, just like it here lost here. So, cooling results in loss of kinetic energy. As that is lost, the particles try to become settled, come closer to each other, the force of attraction increases and it converts itself from solid to, oh sorry, liquid to solid. Okay? 